believe that whatever post-conflict Gaza looks like, the Palestinian people have should have a voice and a vote in what that looks like um, through a revitalized Palestinian authority. We don't believe in any reduction of the size of Gaza. We don't believe and will continue to uh, to be very vocal about the fact that we don't want to see any forcible displacement uh, of Palestinians outside Gaza. Uh, and of course, we don't want to see Gaza dominated or ruled or, or governed over by, by Hamas. Those are very consistent positions. We still hold to them. But the president remains fully committed uh, to the promise and the possibility uh, of a two-state solution uh, and how that can uh, benefit the entire region, certainly with Israeli security guarantee. question about settlements, again, seen in those reports and, and frankly disappointed in the announcement. It's been long-standing U.S. policy under both Republican and Democratic administrations that new settlements are counterproductive to the cause of peace. Frankly, they're also inconsistent with international law. Uh, and this administration maintains this firm opposition, our firm opposition, to settlement expansion. Settlements, uh, we've seen the reports, and um, I have to say we're disappointed in the announcement. Uh, it's been long-standing U.S. policy under Republican and Democratic administrations alike that new settlements are counterproductive to reaching an enduring peace. Uh, they're also inconsistent with international law. Uh, our administration maintains a firm opposition to settlement expansion. نتنياهو يقدم أفكارا يدرك تماما أنها لن تنجح هو أعلن من اليوم الأول أنه يريد تشكيل إدارة في قطاع غزة مدنية تتبع للكيان الصهيوني لم ينجح في ذلك حاول أن يتصل ببعض العائلات والعشائر لتشكيل إدارات جزئية لم ينجح في ذلك رفض الجميع التجاوب معه ورقة يكتب فيها مجموعة من أفكاره المكررة ولكن هذه الورقة لن يكون لها أي واقع أو أي انعكاس عملي لأن واقع غزة وواقع الفلسطينيين يقرره الفلسطينيون أنفسهم المسألة الثانية فهو يصر على الفصل بين الضفة وغزة وعلى الفصل بين القدس والضفة وهذا يعني أن هذا الكيان مخططه الحقيقي هو الاستيلاء على الأراضي الفلسطينية وتفتيتها وليس السماح للفلسطينيين أن يقرروا مصيرهم بأنفسهم فيها
a minha dignidade pela falsidade. E quero dizer para vocês que eu sou favorável à criação do Estado palestino livre e soberano. O que está acontecendo em Israel é um genocídio. São milhares de crianças mortas, milhares de desaparecidas. E não está morrendo um soldado, está morrendo mulheres e crianças dentro do hospital. Se isso não é genocídio, eu não sei o que é genocídio. Eu quero dizer, porque não é possível, não é possível que as pessoas não compreendam o que está acontecendo em Gaza. Não é possível que as pessoas não tenham sensibilidade com milhões de crianças que vão dormir todo santo dia com fome, porque não tem um copo de leite, apesar do mundo produzir alimento em excesso. Thank you.